Well, folks, tonight I am still trying to play catch up. I did not make my numbers last night, but I'm getting closer to hitting them today. I'm at 372. Thanks to my wonderful wife, Kathleen, who jumped in and really helped today while I was dealing with customers. She um, was back here taking photos and was diligent about it. So th kudos to her. Now we're going to try to get these next 28 lots done and hopefully fairly quickly. I don't want to be here till midnight again. I do get what I get. Oh, finally. I got paid for the train. I just sold the train today for, well, I sold it yesterday, but didn't get payment after going back and forth on shipping. It's um, sold it for 100 and ended up being 133 plus $50 shipping. So um, all in all, I received um, I don't know why it says why it said it that way. It it ended up being. Um, Is that the same one? Yep, a hundred and that was really confusing. Okay, I'm gonna go back here home and <laughs> let's see what I what I what did I actually receive? Hundred and thirty three plus fifty dollars shipping. I don't know. I think it ended up being the 133 um, outright. I'll have to figure out why it why it's so crazy. That just didn't make sense to me. So I'm continuing the list. I um, spent the last hour or two out front. A lot of larger items that I had to do. I set up a table. Um, plus, I'm tired of the the deer, all the furry stuff that I do. I had some hides. I think I had four beaver hides and a deer cape that was um, not the normal soft pliable deer cape that I might actually come across it was a little bit stiff still a little pliable but they're older and they weren't very well t tanned and I ended up that fur just falls off of them if you ever hit that like button I appreciate it thank you um, so I did all the nasty stuff out front, which I don't have a camera set up. I do have the, um, I do have camera set up out there. I just don't have the capability of talking and reading the, any messages that might come across the chat. So I'm just going to move right into this consigner, more, um, hard goods, home related stuff. And basically I get, she actually typed out a list for me and I'm going to go through and list everything. And it is shoes off tonight, folks. After a long day on my feet, my dogs are aching. Um, to a bottle, liquor, wine, basket. Going right out of talking about um, dead things to wine. 14 by 10 by 6, 5 and a half. We'll, we'll give it 6. 15 by 10 by 14 by 10 by 6. And all my all my measurements are there. I don't go down to the down to the quarter of an inch or anything like that. I just pretty much. For the for my listings on my auction, right, and is there any markings on here? It is made in China. Let's get a little angle photo going there, and then we're going to take that, get the number off, and that is sixty-three lot sixty-three eleven. So our auction closed tonight. This past week's auction. 
And like I said, we're well on our way to completing the next one. Yeah, there's some men's shirts. Okay, here's a large. I'm gonna put those shirts inside this basket. Mm. Just to fill it out a little bit. It's a leather and what do you call it? Tan, maybe. We're put, still putting in the handbags or purse category, and that's four twenty. Um, large leather and the tan. Beach bag. And I think it's big enough to call it a beach bag. And on the measurements, just a rough, a rough guesstimate. Well, like this, you can pick it upside down. I'll just do across the bottom seam, roughly. Let's say 12. Uh, we'll go out to that green area, 13 inches. 13 by 11. 13 x 11 inch. Completely different than what I would do. Actually, this wouldn't be too different than what I would do on an eBay listing on a bag. But I am not a professional. I never claimed to be. Sometimes I really wonder. Actually, you know, I actually do. I believe that descriptions and pointing out any flaws is probably more important than the quality of photo as long as your photos have good enough quality that you can see those items that you're trying to point out. I don't know. I mean, I still, I, I would consider myself a semi amateur. I'm a beginner photographer, but um, definitely not a professional when it comes to photography. I think my, my photos end up looking okay. I just put two stickers on that. I just... Um, oh, this sounds pretty cool. It is a stoneware teapot with lid. And oh, it's got a lion on it. Is there a maker on it? Let's take that off there. Red Heaton and it is vintage signed. Now we'll go to that in the kitchen. Um, 1981 signed stoneware teapot. Some dimensions on that 11 by 7 and 3 quarter, 11 by 7 and 3 quarter, and 6 and a half. 11. Six, seven and three quarter. Dang it. Seven, three, quarter, X, six. I'll brighten that photo just a little bit. Brightening up your photo sure does um, hide a lot of the dirt in my background. Three thirteen 
So these these videos act as a couple of different things. They help me offer preview to those that might bid on the auction, and they new, and they allow me to share some of the interesting and odd things and maybe things that I may not know about maybe you can help me figure it out or maybe um, I can teach you a thing or two of the things I'm listing or maybe we can learn together this is a salad cutter bowl I've never seen one of these I can see how it works salad Cutter cutting bowl. Oh, this is cutter. And it said sold out. Salad cutter. They probably make a gadget for everything. No mess, no hassle. Finished in 60 minutes, 60 seconds without cutting board. Just one bowl. Nutrition balanced. Never cut your fingers. Somehow I don't think the bowl or the cutting board has anything to do with cutting your fingers. Probably the most uh, the most dangerous item in your kitchen, believe it or not, is not a sharp knife, but a dull one. Or using the improper knife for the job that you're doing. 6314. You're going to hear a lot of worthless information come out of my mouth as I continue to list. Um, but I figure, what is this? Ugh, live, laugh, love. Oh. Yes, one of our favorite things around here. Right behind Avon bottles and um, anything that has collector in front of that. You wonder what I mean? Collector, I mean collector plates, collector dolls, collector shot glasses. Um, they don't typically do too well for us. Where's my Where's my salad cutter bowl? New. There's that. Uh, this is, however, a nice live, laugh, love sign. But most generally, wall decor like this does not do that well because almost everybody has it. But they may not have one like this. They might want to change it out. And that is 11 by 15. You go to any of the antique malls and you will see loads of this type of stuff. This one, I don't know if it was handcrafted, but it seems like everybody is pushing their handcrafted signs like this. Or at least they were you know, a couple months ago. I bought a whole... Hello, Sam. Hey, hey, I hope you're feeling better. Hope your, um, your heart rate is monitored, is leveling out. This is made in Italy. Look at that tray. It's Indian, it looks like to me. No, I don't know. It could be Hawaiian. It almost does. Incan. I wonder if I wonder if Google search will c come up with that. Mean same. Some of these things I find cool. Not necessarily that I would collect them, but um, I do see the value of it in as art. Okay, let's see if Google. I mean eBay image search will help me on this. I might at least see a similar painting or something else and that'll help me 
Interesting that the, the image search on eBay picked up that it was a tray, but did not pick up on any of the art. But it's made in Italy. And they're, they are called uh, Mebel, M-E-B-E-L. Looks like people are trying to get $15 or $20 out of them. Hey, what do you know? That is exactly it. M-E-B-E-L tray made in Italy. That sounds like something that's going to go in the keywords. In the title. Did you get all your listings done last night? For everything that you're trying to get done? 17 and a half by 11 and a half. stable while I'm on my meds just waiting for some appointments to get some answers and solutions well I am hoping that everything gets better and they're able to get that fixed dang it I was just saying I had when I started live stream I just had 27 lots to go to be caught up for the week and that is to hit my 100 a day. I got behind the last couple of days. And just different things going on that had to get taken care of. <laughs> it's like a it's it's like a never ending thing. I I I keep wanting to start. I have a few things I want to put on eBay. But we have also been trying to um, been trying to clean the shop up. Fish going all different directions there. Moved a lot of stuff around the last couple of days. And um, E. Espinar. I can't really tell if that is paint or print. I mean, it, it looks like paint as I block. I'm going to go with paint. And I seriously doubt that eBay search, image search is going to identify this. I got some actual live real art from somebody that some of my customers even recognize that came in the, the shop. Yeah, I'm coming up with stamps. That's not, that's, it's not stamps. Um, some Betty or Marty Bell art that came through. I think I put some I, I took some photos and put them on my Instagram feed that follows through to our store's uh, Facebook page. Hmm. I am going to self-title this Fish Frenzy. Somebody's going to want to buy this just because of the name signed we take the liberty of naming art around here i'm sure people know that it's not really the names of the art 21 and three quarter by 16 and three quarter 21 and three quarter 16 and three quarter 21.75 by 16 Seven five framed. Uh, 
if there is, I guess there's three things that we have dealt with in the shop that I wish I knew more about. And that is stones, or rock, in layman's terms, rocks, and um, art. And there's one other thing. What was it? I wonder if you've seen the other. There's a Hawaiian tray. Large fish frame, painting framed. Okay. Stones, art, and there was one more that I wish I knew more about. Just because there's, there's a lot of money to be made in them, it's just that you have to know what you're... <coughs> I wish I understood the... I think what has happened... I, th and I, I, I question this to myself is... Uh, because of the stuff that we've dealt in the past... Oh, my second favorite thing in the world. Clear glass. A glass bottle with lid. It still smells. Um, two pastel wine glasses, sparkle, picture frame, Ava, Avon granite, Avon, glass bottle with gold rim, two glass bottles with gold tops, clear glass just does not do super well. Um, one of the one of the tricks I did learn from somebody was that um, I need to learn more about coins, but I'm afraid of going down that rabbit hole. You know, um, the only thing. I can tell you is uh, I, I tell you what my my what I've done okay with I mean we sell coins weekly I'm sure everybody's seen them in our auction uh, but the ones that don't sell at my auction but will sell on eBay, and I've done okay on a few a few instances. Is uh, foreign coins? I just sold. I don't know if it was on this account or not. This is stuff that came, and I don't know if it was a coin to the stamps that did it, but I'll see if you can see it through my phone. It's on my other account. Sign out, and then sign in. It'll take me a second to get there. Uh, I've got all my, I, I ordered shipping supplies, so everything is showing all my notifications of what has, what's come in. Th this I sell for $29 and actually cost 26 to ship it to them. It's a um, South Korean, a 50 won, crisp, 10 won. Two one wands and four stamps with no postage marks. 
So $29 and a lot of coins. I don't know if the local um, coin shop does bills, but um, that was $29 for those bills there. There's four, four bills of four stamps. Uh, what else? I had sold some other bills. And I don't know if it was on this account or not. It might have been on the the other one. Um, and that it was Libyan money that I sold. But um, the coins I sell, it's more the collectible, the collector value, not necessarily the silver value that people like collecting silver coins and then it goes it goes a um, quality and then um, that yeah quality and then the rarity or how how many of those coins were minted that year and there you can get lists on the internet they kind of give you a guide um, I, I've done well on Sacagawea dollars setting them up in sets um, I wonder if I if I put in Libya in a search I can't remember what that was a while ago I don't know if I'll even be able to find it it was because it's probably about, I don't know, about a month or two ago I sold those and I can't remember I can't remember which account I sold it off of, to be honest with you. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to find it. It was all about the same time I, I know I listed these. It was Tommy Hilfiger that sold, didn't sell, and I turned around and sold it again. Yeah, it must have been on, on my other account, but I, I got quite a bit for that, too. Right now, I'm pulling out all of this individual's glass. And it will not be lauded all together. I mean, it's not going to be listed separately just because, like, Avon stuff does not typically do well. I mean, if it's themed, that would be one. I mean, I can, I can typically get a little bit for those, but unfortunately, all the people that collected Avon all those years... It um, drastically went down in value. So, I want to get rid of some of this garbage. Actually, That's what I've been looking for instead of just standard ones. I found the smaller Avon bottles and shapes people like, but the larger ones don't sell at all. Um, if you can, if you can team up and lot up, uh, like you know, they had car related ones and you know, gun related ones, like hunting related. I've been able to do okay with those, but 
Not a lot. And that's just through my auction. I don't know if I would ever try to sell Avon um, online. It might do okay, but if I think it would be a long... Okay, this is the large wine goblet, I believe, or vase. Um, glass bottle with lid. So those two, I think, are a lot together. Just because I, I, I won't get a bid on, on one or the other by itself. And I'm probably going to... Two pastel... Wine glasses. There must be another box. <sighs> See, I won't. Be, this is you know. It's, it's sad when I have to tell people I won't be able to sell their um, wares. This looks like the glass was cut. Which I don't understand why. I don't know if somebody was trying. I don't. Is my I need to get. I guess I need to figure out where my camera is, and show it. But this one will go back to the consigner. Just because I would be afraid to drink out of that. Which means that one will. And it's it's really odd because. Both of these are the exact same brand, and you can see there, okay, there they are, they're sitting together. You can see there that, um, it's, <laughs> I, get, I can't get it moved over, I gotta find out where the camera centers, but you can see where the top edge of the one has been cut off exact same part of the same set of glasses but for some reason so those will go back to the consigner and um, i wish i had the tops to that i don't know if i don't have a top to that one that one's probably going to go back as well um, there's still more in the box though that feels like the radio. Okay, let me get let me get her box done. This is probably the hardest thing about what I do. Is having to return stuff because Honestly, folks, I'm not just dropping, breaking stuff. I would never do that to my consigner and stuff. So I did not see the lid to that bottle anywhere. So it's going to go back in this box. I'll put her name on it. And um, I'm going to give her both of these back because they did match. Okay. So those are going to go back to the consigner. Unless I find it. Okay, now. Those are going to go in a lot. Um, return. Small clip in a purse. Advertiser now is very long. This Mrs. Lady is. Okay. Avon White Lady. Avon White Handle. Green bottle, two glass bottle with gold trim, and the two bottles with gold tops I returned. I guess I could, since I'm going to do all those in a lot, oh, what's this one? 
I'm gonna put that with there. So she listed grandfather clock one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, and the rest of them. <laughs> I'm, not, uh, I'm not a huge, huge. I'm not a huge Avon fan. Honestly, look at that. That's gonna make an awesome photo. Sometimes it's just best to pull the band aid off and just get the listing done. 250 for vintage glass, Two, seven luxurious <laughs> Avon bottles. But there may be one collector out there or one brave soul that resells. Up here, anyway, I, I can find it a dime a dozen. I mean, I've gone to sales where I could pick up boxes upon boxes of it, you know, for $40. When I say boxes, I don't mean each, like a, this in box would be one box. This and be, I'm, I'm saying, um, Boxes that are filled with Avon, I could I can find throughout the summer when I'm hitting the sales. I actually someone brought in um, a few weeks ago over 175 pieces that um, that were most of it was in box. A lot of it hadn't even been used. And I think it went for maybe twenty twenty one dollars at my auction, which I was surprised it went it might have hit twenty six, which I was surprised it went that far. Okay, and then I need we'll throw it in the top of this shoe box. And then I'm gonna head over to I'm gonna take all this out. I've got all those things I just listed, I'm gonna take those out to the floor. So I'm going to transition over to the floor cam. I just officially named it that. Uh, not that you're going to see much. It's a zoomed in photo of me walking down the aisle. But hey, it's better than sitting here staring at a at the white screen or the white background, I believe. I could be mistaken. Uh, you guys might prefer to watch the um, watch the white background. I should, I could do a, I could add a transition, we could do a fade, and then, no, that's, um, fade, oh, look at that, okay, I, I'll quit playing now, <laughs> I'll be right back, um, 6318. I might have to make two trips.
Okay, let's see what else we got here. And I'm back. I should actually do these. I want to probably do these over on the um, black background. So I'm going to move back over here. Yeah, I'm going to probably do all these in one lot. The more I thought about it, do the two little like cruette style. Just because glass clear clear glass just does not do real well for me i'm going to balance the i'm kind of anal i like to have um, a little bit of clear space between everything in my photos so Let's see, large wine glass, swivel top bottle, and two, they're actually eight and three quarter, eight and three quarter, they are the same height. Eight and three quarter cruets. If anybody has any questions about what I'm doing, why I'm doing it, what my favorite color is, I really don't have a favorite color, what my favorite food is, I, I will monitor the chat and I will get answers for each and every one of those when I get back over there a little bit closer. This is a, this area over here is where Kathleen is typically, typically working. If you guys are new to the channel and just come in and see what this crazy net job is doing um, and where that voice is coming from, uh, we run an online auction house where everything starts at $3. And in order to get everything online, there's got to be some monkey back here taking photos, writing descriptions, and preparing the catalog each week. And if you are currently an eBay reseller, we, um, I don't know what your typical week is like as far as listings. We're pushing over 500 listings a day between my wife and I. We did recently hire someone to help out and she's mainly helping out in the front soon as soon but she's also doing a heck of a job helping us get organized and um, once she gets once we get all that a lot of this stuff organized when i say organized a lot of it has to do with uh sorting through it but still a bunch of stuff we have and either hauling it off or getting it on the catalog so we can clear up space i've got ideas for some of the space i would love to have some sort of a shipping area Ooh, sorry about that um i'd like to have dedicated spaces to uh set consigner drop-offs you still doing ice cream this summer in addition to the auctions? Yes. That's the other thing with our help. I want to train her how to do photos as well so I can get some help there. And because um, Kathleen is going to be hitting that pretty hard here probably sometime this month. And she'll be starting to hire. If anybody here local or if, if you know anybody local that needs a good paying job, we do do a background check on all of our employees that we hire through to drive the ice cream trucks. Um, but we're going to need a few drivers to handle that. So um, the one thing going 
uh, yeah, I, I quit my job last year in June, but it was still a challenge, and we kind of let we loosened up on some of the responsibility our responsibilities on the ice cream truck, and we weren't as um, we didn't hit it quite as hard as we could have, but we are going to be. Okay, the earplugs and the batteries are going in the return pile. Um, so we really want to get three, all three trucks out this summer. And that is on top of running the concession stand, which um, is a task all in itself. Kathleen does a heck of a job trying to manage, or managing, I say try managing the ice cream business and concession business. But we usually have um, kids run the concession stand. I'm trying to figure out if there was, there's not a disc in here. I need a disc. I had a CD in here just for this. Oh, that's oh, that's a movie, dude. Where's my car? Um, dang it! I love to test radios and CD players. But yeah, like I said, she'll be hitting that pretty hard here in the next month. Getting employees hired. Uh, cleaning out the trailer, I'll probably be pulling it out in the next couple of weeks just to make sure everything is A-OK -okay with that. I mean, I've never photographed anything like this. This is like, I cannot even imagine going sitting down to the beach. I guess for your room, if you want a stereo that takes up little space. Um, tiny home CD player. That's what I'll call this. 510. CD player. I'll put, I'll put it in the description. With external... We're going to say plus because it's going to be like it's a bonus. Plus external speakers. And I'm going to put AC adapter included. I hope it didn't like included. It's too, much, too many letters. Put that down in the description. AC adapter included. The um, the ice cream business is pretty much what's going to keep us keep us going year over year until I I get move into the period that I actually get to draw a paycheck from this job. Perfect sound system. For your uh, a <laughs> tiny home. If I say for your tiny home, they might live in a large house and might take offense to me calling their home tiny. I really wish I could clean these cables up a little bit. I mean, if I saw that, I would be like, I don't want all that monstrosity in my house. 
And then I've got all this glass over here. Okay. Trick photography. Okay. I'm going to put that back in the bag. I really should get all this glass out of here before I break something. It came in a bag, honestly, folks. I'm just putting it in a different bag. Sixty-three twenty. Super nice lady that brought brings all this that brought this stuff in. But she'll get her first rejects. I'll, I'll let her down softly. Okay, so let's see what else she's got here. Dig deep in her box of goodies. Okay, a sparkly picture frame. Um, unless I can put that with something else, we will put it with the coconut purse made in Hawaii. Raised in the sun. C and H. Okay. Okay. Sometimes when you buy things at auction, you have to take the good with the not so good. And we'll see how that how it goes. We'll put this under uh, three home decor. <laughs> okay. Let's leave with coconut purse. Sun. Lidded clay pots. Uh, 
I need to actually trinket boxes. Plus. Okay. Also in this, oops. Also included in this lot is a sparkly picture frame and owl and bee spreaders. Also included in this lot are owl and bee cheese spreaders, comma, sparkly frame and a playful kitten candle holder. Also included in this lot, RL, R, R, L, and B. It almost listened to everything I said. Candle holders are one of our favorite things, right below. Avon bottles, clear glass, anything with the word collectible in it, then candle holders, our favorite things that I brought in on auction. It's not that they're not beautiful items, it's just that I don't have the buyers for their beautiful treasures. And I'll throw an extra picture in there too. I guarantee you'll pay, pay more for this stuff at Goodwill than you will at our auction house. And I need a box. The next consigner I have usually brings in some pretty good stuff too. You know what? I can't do it. I can't do it. The sparkly frame is going to go. The bee and owl cheese spreaders have got to go. I'll have to rephotograph, and I will leave the pumpkin. The okay. I've been trying to be a little bit harder on what I reject, but. Sometimes my heart gets in the way and I'm like, I can't tell these people that I mean the these little trinket boxes, they're cute. But I have to sell I have to be able to sell the coconut purse and kitty cat too. I'm not saying I'm sticking them with the items, but I kind of am. box.
I'll have the person bidding on the coconut purse against the person bidding on the other. I'm going to get a couple more things from a different consigner and put this out on the shelf. I'll be right back. By the time I've been doing this for a couple of years, I will be able to tell you what anything is. Okay. I thought I would pick out things that would be easier to identify. Oh, this is... That's why it's so freaking heavy. It is... Restore liquid armor surface replacement. Basically, you redo your decks, your patios, water based, low odor. Create great for concrete, too. Boat docks, pill decks, patios. It looks like it is something to resurface your surface to make it a little bit rougher, maybe a little slip resistant. Um, we're going to change this over to um, CK. And I think I will put this one under Outdoors 550. The only thing I have left. I only saw two appetizer lines in there. Small kitty returned. Um, check, check, return. And then the earrings and pins is all I have left of hers. Okay. I always mark the stuff that I have on the sheet as I go through it. It keeps me somewhat sane. Deck restore. Open unused. Not Deco Tessie. Deck restore. I think my phone is stupid. Liquid armor resurfacer. Res yeah. Resurfacer. Er. Open box, but unused. Well, that totally did not. That was saying completely opposite. It said open box and used. Not quite, uh, not quite what I was going for there. I'll have to carry this with both hands to get it back out on the floor. Six, three, two, two. Okay, I'm gonna come back and see where I'm at.
Isabella's school there. Uh, jazz play, jazz band is one, playing at one of the local restaurants slash bars. It's actually a restaurant, but they have a bar area downstairs where they, it's part of the restaurant as well. But they'll go there and play uh, music. And the jazz band at the school is pretty pretty good. Um, so we're, we were wanting to go there to eat dinner and listen to them play. But the only way I can do that is if I get caught back up on listings. I mean, we don't actually launch until Friday evening, and we're just trying to get to a um, minimum of 500 Trades Pro. Friday evening and, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, six, seven, eight. So 33 feasts, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 2, 24, 26, 28, 32, 33. 33 piece. I don't even know what I was saying before I left. Um, So yeah, so I, I, we still have into Thursday that we can finish up our catalog for Friday, or into Friday that we can still um, catalog, but I try to get out of the shop before uh, around 4, 4.30, that way I can go to auction. And yes, I can be considered part of my job too except that I enjoy doing it. I go and buy quite a bit at auction and um, I, I love it. So my downtime on a Friday night is going to buy stuff. And right now I am sitting at menu stats 385 only got 15 more items to go I'll go ahead and take a picture of this before this is still is this new this is new um, air fit adjustable pillow the latest innovation and in comfort revolutionary Revolutionary air fit technology inside. Menu, lots, new lot, and that's gonna go into bedroom. 350. So I'm, I'm trying to grab things that I can list quickly. I always try to spell I, every time I say adjustable I wonder if it's I honestly have to think is it adjustable or able able and we'll just take a picture of all the around the box And it keeps me from having to uh, type in exactly what it is. Most people look at photographs anyway. So I let them read off of the off the box. OK, 
Okay. 14. 6, 3, 2, 4. And I almost forgot. What's that he got in his hands, you say? I have no idea. They are... Is it some kind of projector, I wonder? Google helps me out. It's Lumens is the brand. It's got a camera on it. Um, DC one five three. Hello. Okay, we'll figure it out. We'll I'll, I'll take a look at it. Okay. Yeah, I got 15 more, 14 more to go. Because we were wanting to take off early tomorrow night. Okay, let me get a few more done and then I'll be ready. Okay, let me work till 11. 10.45. I love you. I'm looking at my computer. I'm live streaming right now. Hello? I can't... Oh, I'm live streaming right now, so I'm looking at the camera. Or were you talking to Isabella? Are, are you? You said, are, what are you looking at? I said, I'm looking at the computer screen. No, I said, I'm looking at my lamp. Let me go look at your lamp real quick. I was actually in the middle of taking pictures of...
Well, that was swell. I had to uh, go take a photo of this lamp and here it brought it, well, like Kathleen, she's the one that got it. Whoever she bought it from had filled it quite full with oil. So now I have oil all over my hands. Interesting enough, it's odorless. Um, okay, so these I had to Google because I had never seen these before. Okay. Oh, because my wife is using it. She can't, she has to delete the, okay. They're document projectors. Lumens document camera presenter. Um, we're going to go to Amazon and take the. Oh. It might not back up. I only see the store. Oh, I see you now. I told you but red um i don't even know what you're go where you're going with that hello say hello to um sue ann she's back in they call them uh ladybugs And there's three of them. <laughs> I'm like, but I see the red lamps. I see my face in the bottom right hand corner. And the CK. Okay, and these are electronics. Three. These should work. They're probably just pulled out of school because. They were, um, okay, that's all I'm going to do. There's Sue is probably busy working and resting, I hope. Okay, I'm going to do it like that. That way people can see the cameras and to, as well. Kathleen, go ahead and delete the image that you did at the bottom. And um, it should be good. And yes, you told me about the oil. I did not realize it was that full. a picture of all the outputs and inputs and everything else it does not have power cords why do they always anything that comes out of school which i'm sure this is where they came out of originally they never have the my score of the night from your auction was the micro set oh wow i have not even I haven't even looked at, um, I've been up here working the whole evening. Kathleen, I think, hit the button to send the invoices. There's usually, there's usually items that are auctioned. Well, I would say there are. It depends on what your niche is. 
but there i would say every week i have something that even if you if you just bought one thing it would cover the cost of shipping and the item and you could make profit on it um I've got quite a few resellers that buy buy items from me that I ship out each week. And I tell people if you're a reseller and you're buying in from us, there's two options. You either buy more items to balance out the cost of shipping among all those items purchased, or buy smaller items that I can I, I can ship at a lower rate. I'm trying to get used to doing the whole transition thing. I need to get a hotkey set up. That way I can just hit it. Let's see what kind of goodies are in this box. We have a, well that's kind of cool. It does have some, definitely age has not been its friend. It is a wooden, and the inside is porcelain. Is it porcelain? I can't tell, it might be plastic. No, it's porcelain. And chrome um, ice bucket. It does have a split right here, which is unfortunate. And I don't know if that can be repaired. It probably could by the right person that does wood woodwork. But it's still cool. We have AudioVox. Are these digital recorders or? Oh, those are um, little walkie-talkies. Those will be listed as untested. We have a electric timer. Looks like it's never been used. It hasn't seen the weather. We have a pair of uh, fingerless gloves. Except Oh, Flexin, it is sealed. 
Dot Pain Flexum CM8 Joint Health Mobility Solution. That must have cured their joint. We have Alone hardcover. It is at least 1938. People used to write the years. Yeah, 1938 alone by. Richard E. Harrison. Oh, I see this one. Tarzan, Edgar Allen, Edgar Rice Burrow, Tarzan and the Forbidden City. I guess I should hold that up over there. Um, it is missing the the end, the binding cover, and this is. I would have to look. Copyright MCMM XXXVIII. -I -I. So something eight. Oh, that book is heavy. The Study of Interior Decoration, 1928, and it even has color photos. That's kind of cool. Always thumb through, thumb through the old books to make sure that you, there's, they didn't leave money in it. Um, we have these Hall China Company for the Regency Hotel. Little, um, I don't know if those would be sauce dishes. Those are kind of cool. And we have wood, small furniture you can make, and cactus and succulents. Hmm. And a set of nutcracker set, a nut, nutcracker set. So. Okay, let's do the, real quick. Let's do the. Those are sealed, and it's a supplement. He just didn't want me to lose the instructions. Flexin joint and health solution and got pain visit flexin.com is there a date on them show me the Tarzan again I want to see the cover I've actually sold Edgar Rice Burrow books before. Are you just wanting to look at a topless man? He's wearing pants, a loincloth. Well, I will put the date. I, I'll make sure to put the date. I don't know if that's a manufacturer date. Um, or if it's a, a expiration, so I'll make sure to put that in there. Um, black background. I don't know. It looks like it's got a, a blue background to me, but you know me, I'm colorblind. Okay. I don't know where that would go. Hey, thanks, Sue Ann. Um, get some rest. And um, we're still praying for you. Hope everything goes good with your appointments and you get nothing but positive news. But um, have a great night. Bathroom.
You're so funny. <laughs> okay, bathroom. We're three fifty. Um. One what? Oh, you're looking at comps for me? C, C, M, eight. It does have a ten slash eight on the back. I'm not sure if that's expiration or date it was produced. Have had to. Okay, we're going to do it just like that so I can see everything. Hundred and eighty capsules. I have no idea what you're talking about. Joint health. and mobility. sure that the um, relief that someone's going to be work be relieved the pain that they're going to be relieved from from this is independent of course it was independent um, studies have shown that it was to reduce pain and improve joint health six three two seven should go in. I'm going to go over to the black background. Yep. That's my dog. The, these little plates have R for rod. I'm going to have a couple cold beers when I get home. I believe these saucers Hall China. Why does Hall China sound familiar? Hall China for Regency Hotel. They're hotel butter dishes, and they, um, they sold for ten fifty at each. It's very interesting how it, these would have made it all the way over here to North Idaho. They are vintage Hall China. Um, D 
dishes made for the Regency Hotel in New York, according to my research. I would probably um, lot these together if I was to do them on eBay and probably put a, I'd probably load four of them. I'd probably try to get $40 out of them plus shipping. I know. Okay, that's them. Let's do. I'm sure it's for Rob. I'm talking that book. I'm sure it's for Rob. We need more knives on the next auction. Okay, well, we can definitely do that. It's a shame that that's split. That's kind of a cool ice bucket. Two hundred vintage wood. Porcelain, crown, ice, bucket with handle. There is a split down one side to the right of the shield. See, I told you it was perfect. reason I say it's porcelain I mean it almost looks plastic the only reason I say it's porcelain is because you can see some of the crackling that porcelain has over time that um, plastic does not do 6328 I did say the, oh, is that what you're joking about? It probably was an R for Rob. Ha ha. That book is so freaking heavy. Um, I'm just going to put old books and put them all together. Okay, looks like I got one more minute to do. I got this this um, three old books. I got this listing that I'm gonna knock off the stream. Tarzan. Alone. And um, study of interior decorating. Study 
of interior. It's hard to comment on what you say. Oh, because of the delay. That's why it's good to have a good moder moderator so they can answer for me. I should make you my moderator. Oh, you do have a wrench. Okay, let's get these pictures done and then I'll take this stuff out to the floor and then I will be out of here. There's a delay when you read the comments. So they don't make sense. Just like you're typing. Oh. What the heck does Shiri have to do with it? Okay, that is it. I'm going to take this stuff out to the floor. And um, I did not lose my pants once tonight. 6389. I did not wear a belt. So I, I worry about that sometimes. Whether I keep them pulled up or not. Okay, let's get these items. And let's see. Folks, it looks like I ended with. 391. I was only nine shy of my goal. Um, but uh, it's close. I, we, we've made gain. I think I was 40 behind or 30 behind last night. So we've made progress thanks to Kathleen working today and me continuing the effort this evening. Um, we'll see how well we do tomorrow during the day So we because we were planning on taking the evening off. To go spend time together as a family. So I'm going to go put these away. Then I'm probably going to head out. As I said, folks, this is it for tonight. Um, for everybody that jump, did jump in, thank you for uh, hanging out with me while I sat here and worked. We will catch you next time. Peace out.